To create a new campaign, choose the campaign type from the New Campaign menu. For this video, we'll be building a website campaign. Creating a new campaign starts by filling in the campaign basics. First, you need to decide whether you want the campaign to be saved in online or offline mode. If it starts in online mode, your campaign could start running as soon as the campaign is saved. If you're not using flight dates, it's generally recommended to start your campaign in offline mode. If you are using day parting, you might want to start your campaign in online mode. Next, name your campaign and enter the destination URL in the spaces provided. The destination URL is the web page that your users will be sent to when they click on your ads. Flight dates are optional and are used to control the dates that your campaign will run. Day parting is also optional and allows you to control the time of day and the days of the week your campaign will run. Day parting can be a useful tool for campaign optimization. Even if you run your campaign without day parting, you may discover later that your campaign performs better at certain times of the day or on certain days of the week. Frequency cap allows you to control the number of times your ad is shown to a unique user. The default setting is 3 over 12, indicating that your ad will be shown to any given user three times within a 12 hour period. If you change this setting to 1 over 24, for example, each unique user will only see your ad once every 24 hours. More advanced frequency cap settings will be discussed in a separate video. Continue on to part two of the campaign creation tutorial where we will cover geotargeting.